I've been a fan of Quentin's work for a long time, and I love the fact that he was, you know, sort of recreating his own history in a deeply American, you know, uh, context with these, with this sort of spaghetti western Sergio Leone genre mixed into it, something only Quentin Tarantino can do. And and this character, you know, really reminded me of a young sort of Louis the Fourteenth that was rotting from the inside, and as he put it, which I like to say, is, is somebody that uh, really represented the moral decay of the South during that time period. I mean, he was the worst of the worst of plantation owners, and I, I you know, it was, it was too well written to pass up, and um, I'd always wanted to work with Jamie Foxx, and of course, you know, the great Christoph Waltz and Sam Jackson. There was too many great elements to this movie to to ever look away. It's a fantasy film in a lot of different respects. I mean, you know, uh, just like Inglorious Bastard was, he's sort of recreating history, but there's nothing in the film that isn't historically accurate as far as what these people were like during that time period. He's an amazing actor, first off, and he's such a, a powerful force when it comes on set. I mean, you read you read your dialogue and you think about the scene in a very specific way and then this tornado just comes in that is Sam Jackson and you need to step up to the plate and <laughs> and, and 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 try to bring yourself up to that energy because he just takes over and it's amazing. I mean, what he did with this role is, is astounding. 